Hello.
All right, what's up, everyone? Hey, guys, thank you so much for plugging into the conference call. We're about to get started right now. Uh, here, one second. All right. All right, perfect, guys. <clears throat> That's <I'm> right. <laughs> We're heading towards there. All right, guys. Well, thank you so much, guys, for getting to, uh, on on the on the Zoom conference video call. Um, it's going to be a very you know informative and a, and a very fast um, presentation, real fast about what what the opportunity is uh, being associated with our company right now. And you know, un unless you've been living under a rock, you guys know what's going on right now. That you know, everybody, you know, the economy is like where it's all over the place. But right now, our company is in a very important, uh, critical position where we're helping more people than ever before. Um, we're getting an abundance of, of clients calling us, texting us, asking us, hey, you know, how, how is my protection? How is my service? Uh, it, it, you know, if I get impacted with this, does it affect my policy? And, uh, you know, we have a lot of demand for what we do right now, guys. So we just want to pass on the information to everyone. That way, you know, uh, you know, what kind of company we are, what exactly are, are we teaching families and what's in it for you if you decide to get, you know, partnered up with us as a client or one of our agents. So anyways, guys, it's going to be, um, I'm going to start right now, guys. Um, so again, hop, uh, thank you so much for hopping in on the call. So if you guys can do me a favor, I'm seeing that everybody is doing it. Um, all right, we have Marcus Jones. Just make sure that you meet yourself. But other than that, all right, let's let's uh, let's get this going. So let me share my screen real fast. All right, can anybody can everybody see my screen? Yes. Yes. <clears throat> okay, perfect. All right, guys. Well, um, I know that some people are on the conference call that might be here for the very first time, but our company. Primerica, um, like I was saying before, right now we're in a situation where we can bless other people um, being associated with us. Uh, you know, right now we're having this kind of conference call because we want to get more people to be associated with us in two ways. One, as a client, and, and two, who knows, maybe as a referral partner with whoever invited you to the conference call. So this is the company Primerica. We've been around for, for about 40 something years. And I'm just gonna share something really fast with everyone. Uh, it's a simple concept. You know, we had a three o'clock uh, conference call right now in Spanish, which by the way, one of our agents, Ellie, did an amazing job. But let me show this with you guys real fast. So um, this is an image uh, of a concept that we call life insurance. Uh, another word for life insurance is called income protection. Um, so basically, you know, on the first part of the, of the picture, it says, this is your family. You are the provider of the family, right? In a, in a, in a average family, there's two breadwinners, right? You got mom, uh, you got dad, you got kids, you got groceries that you need to take care of. You got tuition fees, bills, rent, all the stuff, right? Now check this out. The only thing guaranteed in life for all of us, regardless of the coronavirus is around or not, the, re the reality is we're all gonna, we all have an expiration date. We're all gonna pass away. Um, so the question is not a matter of if you are not gonna die, it's a matter of when, but let me give you a scenario. It says right here on the second one, if you die without life insurance, your family will have a hard time to adjust to the lifestyle they are used to. Why? Because as a breadwinner, right? You're providing income for your family, right? You, you're bringing in income to every two weeks or every week, depending on your job, you're getting paid week to week to week to week. And, and when something finally does happen to you, you know, you got two choices. Either you leave them with a bill or you leave them with some sort of protection. And that's exactly what we're talking about in this, uh, in this case. 
Um, so let's say, for example, you have no protection. You've never heard of life insurance. You've never heard of income protection. You're like, what is that? Life insurance. Like, do I insure my life? Uh, it, it sounds a little, you know, weird, right? But basically, what life insurance does is, look, if you see the bottom of, of the graphic, it says, if you die with life insurance, your family is protected and will have reasonable time to adjust from your absence. Why? Because when you have, when you qualify for something called life insurance, it's kind of, think about it kind of like car insurance, that you're paying your premiums month to month to month to month, and when you finally hit somebody or somebody hits you, right, uh, there's a company that's going to back you up financially. In this case, we're talking about insuring the most important things to our family, which is us. So in the event that something happens to you and, and you have, uh, you know, the right kind of life insurance in place for you and your family, the moment you pass away, there's a financial backing that comes to your family. That way right here, mom can at least handle herself now without having to sacrifice more time with the kids by getting a second job or, or, or you know, I'm going to I'm going to talk about something else right now called GoFundMe. But, you know, the reality is you leave your family in better hands simply because you are wise enough to know that, hey, we're, we're not we're not invincible. Right. We're, we're, we have an expiration date. You know, uh, like I was saying before, you know, regardless of what's happening around the world, a new virus is going to come out later on. New situations are going to happen later on. But the only thing that's for sure is that we, we all have an expiration date. But it's important for all of us, especially breadwinners, to have a family. Uh, it's very important that we take care of our family financially. Okay, I think some people were talking. All right, can you guys hear me well? Yes, we yeah. can hear you. All right, perfect. So um, that's basically the concept of life insurance, guys. It's a it's a very simple. As long as you have a life insurance in place, if something God hap God God forbid happens to you, you're protected. No questions asked. The only thing, you know, not every policy is the same way, but I can talk for our company. The only thing that would exclude you from being protected is if you do something like suicide the first two years. But it covers absolutely everything. Uh, if you die in a car accident, if you if something happens to you on the road, if something happens to you at home, at your job, or outside of your job. Coronavirus, and it also protects against the coronavirus, believe it or not. It covers absolutely everything as long as you qualify for a plan like that. So anyways, guys, uh, that's really fast what I wanted to show with you guys. I hope that you guys got the basic gist uh, uh, of the importance of having life insurance. But let me share something with you guys really fast because I was actually looking this up earlier. Um, so what's the alternative? So some people on the conference call, you're probably like, okay, so but why are we talking about life insurance, right? Well, I like to believe, guys, that this is, we're in a very special moment, um, and this is global. This is, we're in a very special moment where people are starting to become more self-aware uh, of our, uh, of us not being, like, eternal, right? We're, we're not here forever, you know, in a, in, a, in a flicker, something could happen to your family where, where you know, if a, if a breadwinner were to pass away, it could totally devastate your whole family. It could devastate everybody's plans. You know, for example, right now, the coronavirus, it happened out of nowhere, and all your plans that you had for March, April, or maybe even the summer, it's gone. Boom, like that. Same thing, but and now when it comes to your family, you know, nobody is prepared for death. I mean, not, not, not a lot of people will wake up like, okay, um, you know, I, am I okay? This, and that. Like, this is something that happens out of nowhere, right? That happens out of nowhere. But as a breadwinner, it's your responsibility, and even not as a breadwinner, if you have people that depend on you or, or you, you're living in a house where if you were to pass away, immediately they get a $20,000, you know, debt because of, of a funeral expense, you know, it's very important for you to have some, something like that too in place, you get me? So anyways, um, the alternative of not having life insurance is, look, for us Hispanics, I don't know if, if there's, there's some people on the conference call that are Hispanics, um, we do something called kermeses. I know that every, every, everybody out there, you know, when you don't have life insurance and you pass away, we do car washes, um, we sell stuff, we have estate sales, um, but there's something new that's been going around recently called GoFundMe, which if you have Facebook or Instagram, you might likely face something like this one day, but it's a service called, here, let me pull it up. It's a service called GoFundMe. Now, why am I sharing that with you? Because when you pass away, like I was mentioning before, it's a fifteen to twenty thousand uh, dollar 
uh, bill that your family inherits when you finally pass away. Now, the question is, which family has 15 or 20,000 ready to go in an instant? And the reality is not a lot of families out there are ready like that. You get me? Most families live paycheck to paycheck. So in this case, uh, I, I searched it up real fast, you know, GoFundMe. So GoFundMe, it's a link where if you post it, uh, let's say on your social media, you can fundraise for absolutely everything. And a lot of people use GoFundMe as a last minute resort thing for a funeral. So check this out. If you were to go on GoFundMe, and for example, let's say you type in funeral. Check this out. That's two million eight hundred and ninety thousand active accounts. Active. Two million families, different families, having to ask people for help. So the question is, do we have a need for what we do? The, the answer is absolutely we do. But a, a lot of people don't know that it's a need that they need. You get me? it's all about awareness. So what we're, what we're looking for right now, the reason why we're having these Zoom meeting calls is, is to pass on the awareness to others that, hey, number one, we're not gonna live forever. Number two, especially in these kinds of moments where the, the, the future has always been uncertain, but especially more now than ever before, you need to be protected. You gotta have something in place because if something happens to you, like I was mentioning before, it's all going to, you know, pretty much be bad for the family. You get me? And, and man, we have, we've been doing quotes left and right. We've seen some quotes that, man, we, we're starting off at $15 a month. I mean, it doesn't, even if, for example, you don't make a lot of money, $15, it's not a lot of money if you have the vision of, well, 15 bucks, I can probably spend it on Starbucks or something else. But man, I, I'm going to invest it in my family because they don't deserve, uh, you know, to go through this because I didn't take care of myself, because I didn't, I didn't foresee the future, you get me? So we have quotes, like if we start off at 15 bucks a month, you get me? So if I were you guys, if you're on the Zoom call for the very first time, if you're interested in a service like that or want more details as far as, you know, how does it work, what's a quote base, because every quote is different depending on the person. If you have more questions towards that, I would definitely advise you to message, get on a Zoom call with the person that, that, that sent you this link and, and they are experts. They're definitely going to let you know how it works, what are the ins and outs of our, of our program, and how affordable it is to any family to have something like this. Does that make any sense? So anyways, guys, you know, before we wrap it up, um, another reason why we're doing these, uh, the, the Zoom call as well, because right now, like I'm saying, we have a high demand for what we do. Now, what we're also trying to do is we're trying to pass on the message of, hey, what it, right now, for example, a lot of companies are letting people go. Uh, the majority of people, either their hours got cut, they're, now they're working from home, or they're unemployed, right? And they didn't, they, didn't, they didn't see it coming. Nobody saw it coming. So right now, Prime America has, uh, has an amazing opportunity for the public that if you become associated with us, either as an agent to do what we do and help out families, or becoming a referral agent, meaning you pass on people that you can think of that could use the information uh, pass it on to the people that invited you to the call. We have a, a special promotion that the company is willing to sponsor almost absolutely everything as long as you pass a background check. If, you, if you're willing to pass a background check, the company is willing to sponsor absolutely everything that you need just by becoming associated with us, which by the way, uh, not every insurance company, we're the only insurance company out there that's willing to sponsor absolutely everything just as long as you pass a background check, guys. Um, but other than that, right now, like it says right here, start your insurance licensing online today. Thank God that now we live in an era of technology. Everybody has computer. If not a computer, you at least have a cell phone where you can, you know, do your classes. It's very easy. The person that invited you to the call, they can act absolutely explain to you how the online classes work as well. So anyways, guys, um, that's pretty much it. Like I said, if you want to be associated with the company, as far as a referring agent or a part-time agent at least or, or even more interested more towards the, the the details of the life insurance just please message the person that invited you to the zoom call they can absolutely answer everything but anyways guys thank you so much for plugging into the zoom call we love you guys stay safe wash your hands uh shower right uh and stay safe guys all right thank you so much for plugging in bye-bye